And I think that's the same thing with like somebody like Crashy, for example, right? Like people really dislike Crashy, but Crashy can see the vision for the game. He like he is passionate about the vision for the game, but the game is just not going in the direction that he thinks it needs to go to be successful. And it's not going to reach the vision that he has for it because it's failing to be successful at the current like iteration of the game. Good thing I went at any point with the team. I mean, yes and kind of no. I think that kind of comes from a uh, casual mode perspective. This is just like, it's too competitive of a game mode for a new player, in my opinion. Because, like, you expect a new player to learn the, like, the character and then learn the heroes. Or, uh, sorry, learn the heroes, learn the items, learn how to actually play their lane, learn how to team. But, like, you expect that you're expecting too much of new players. You have to have a casual game mode to teach players certain mechanics, and then they go into the competitive game mode, and then they learn additional mechanics on top of the mechanics they've already learned. I think it was the dark that come up with a huge update that fixed a lot of the current problems. I would be more surprised than anything. Probably quit like cigarettes. Does that mean like you actually quit or like you're addicted so you didn't actually quit? I'm kind of confused. <laughs> Right, no P could be so amazing, but again, could be. Yeah, I think could be is like, like if either of these games shut down, I'm gonna be so disappointed because I'm like, I really feel like either game could be super popular if they just did like a few changes or like were a little bit faster in this regard or that regard. Like I actually feel like either game could easily succeed, like and be very successful. Was addicted to it too much? Terrible addiction. Hey, it'd be like that sometimes. Make things accessible, making things brain dead is another. There's a difference between accessible and dumbing the game down. I think Pred's done a good job of dumbing the game down instead of a good job of making it accessible. So now it's like dumb so you don't retain the high players and then it's, uh, what's it called? It also doesn't uh, attract new players. Be so sick you want to end it all? Is that how you feel right now, Wally? I'm sorry to hear that, man. Just throw it a little cheeky pressure gank, that's all. A little poke. A little poke. I got nothing else to do for a little bit, so I might as well. Make sure to remember to buy Sentry. Don't be weird. You're just gonna be weird, huh? I hope he dies for that. Just being stupid. You're not a goddamn. Okay, good. Dude, how does he know I'm there, man? And now you're just dead for being a dumbass. Now you just look fucking stupid. First of all, how do you even know I'm sitting there? But there's no way you had enough pressure to actually get a word there and it would still be there. Like, I just don't believe that. There's a wrong fucking item. Anyways, go back to base, shitter. You don't cater to casuals, you cater just enough. Honestly, I kind of disagree with that, like, in general. I, I kind of disagree with that philosophy. I explain how Obelisk works. So you activate Obelisk, it gives you extra damage on your next auto attack. Whatever you auto attack, uh, if it dies from the auto attack or th within three seconds after the auto attack, uh, what's it called? Um, you get one stack. Each stack is equal to one power, and then it also increases the amount of damage that the auto attack would do when you activate it. Am I playing this game? Why not Smite? Smite one's just kind of dead to me, honestly, in terms of uh, growth. Like, it's not a good growth game in terms of content, and it's not a good competitive game. I mean, there's no competitive scene for Smite one now uh, in season 11, but uh, since Smite two's going around. But just like as a competitive player, there's no growth as like potential to reach uh, the heights because the game's just been out for so long. Not even because, like, you don't have the skill level to, it's just, like, it's kind of a friendship thing. Uh, the last, like, four or five years of Smite, unfortunately. Those are, like, the two big ones. But I'm pretty excited for Smite 2. 
It's going to be a good time for content, good time for competitive players to get into the game. It's going to be a fantastic time, I think. I don't know if I'll main it. Like, I'll probably do, like, a little bit of back and forth of Pred and uh, Smite 2, especially since Smite 2 is only going to be available on weekends for a little bit. But uh, I'm pretty excited to try it. I'm just excited for a new MOBA, honestly. I love MOBAs. I love MOBAs. I love third-person MOBAs. I want all of them to do well. Oh, yeah, if this game, OP, Smite 2, and Ethereal could all survive, I would want that, honestly. I also have skill expression. I uh, also have to have uh, Timmy get to and enjoy himself. I mean, I would agree. True. Like, I don't disagree with you. I just think Pred kind of fails to do both of those things. I think Pred fails to retain the competitive players, and it also fails to retain the casual players, too. Or, like, the majority of them, I should say. Because obviously retain some. I love Pred. Dude, I do. Like, I say that as a joke. Like, I say it sarcastically. But I do actually like the game. Like, I, I really do. Oh, he died. Nice. God, this song is so shit. Really, you're in your wild look, MOBA. Is that a mobile game? Will they get mini? It's like kind of whatever, though. I don't really care about mini. Skip it. I'm listening to it, bro. You didn't skip. I'm listening to it, man. Let me listen. Quiet. Y'all are ruining the song, man. I can remember it coming out. On I think there was talks about it coming out on console, but I don't think it ever did come out on console. Everyone type louder. <laughs> True. This guy my five camp, bro. Get away from my five, you weirdo. What's up, Chubei? What are we upset about today? I could drink some water. You see a lot of words in chat. Is it wrong to have words? I kiss my bald head, huh? First of all, I'm not even bald, dude. Are you know Walmart ranks like fighting over pizza crust you found on the ground? That's like such a weird analogy. First off, what the fuck? <laughs> like that crust isn't the best part of the pizza. That's a joke. That's a joke, obviously. It's 
Spider to one-hit minion? Fuck that minion. I was like, foolish, stop typing like children. Who is arguing? Are they acting like, are you actually like seriously arguing about Walmart MMR or not? I can't tell. So I've been reading a ton of the chat. Some crowds do be better. Nah. That's just incorrect. You're amusing yourself? Amuse these. How about that? Fucking got him. Stupid. Pizza be ass. Yeah, but even ass pizza is still good pizza. To be honest here. You can't really fuck it up. It's like chicky tens. It's pretty hard to fuck up. Like, if you got bad chicky tens, that's a problem. The people use Amina City to talk shit? Yeah, and those people are fucking stupid. I tell them straight to their stupid fucking faces that they're stupid. She gets to live, and then I get rooted. He still has root? I get in killed him at least, I guess. Two for two. This is a bad link. Uh, it's not a bad link. It's just that you don't have, a, like, a sub badge or anything like that. I just have all links blocked for people that aren't, like, somewhat invested via any type of badge, whether that be a sub or, like, a VIP or something like that. Otherwise, people would be posting some wild shit, and I don't like that. Just a timeout, that's all. Like a one second purge. You have a compliment? Wait, what, what happened? The right being weak in his Omita's bronze, it's still worth considering. That has something to do with Omita City. That's just people that don't understand the game. That's called top-down balance. I wouldn't even have to look at the Omita City to tell it to know that. Anybody that actively thinks Wraith is just not good, is just not actively good at the game. And I can tell you that because anybody that actively plays in like a tournament setting, for example, or scrims, and they it, like if somebody played in a scrim, right, against like a high level team, and they were like, Wraith sucks, right? I feel like you have more validity. But if you're Little Timmy 27, like if your name is literally Little Timmy 27, Jimmy John 86, like, yeah, I'm sorry, your opinion's like less relevant. If I don't actively see you in my games, if I don't actively know you, your opinion's less relevant to me, I'm sorry. Just the truth. If you start whatever argument you have as an original Paragon this, you're, I stop listening to you because your opinion's irrelevant. It's going to be a dog shit opinion. I can already tell just by just by how you started your statement. I can already tell you're going to be a fucking idiot. I value Mercy's opinions. Not really, no. But Mercy's proven that I shouldn't value his opinions. Now, uh, Percy cleaned up his act and stopped being dumb and was like, Shinbi Fire Blossom is good. I might val I might respect his opinion a little bit more. Unfortunately, he doesn't do that, so his opinion's irrelevant to me. I'm just gonna wait for my smite to be up. You ain't shit. You ain't shit, Murdoch. You ain't shit. Mm. Sit bank. Yeah, he does. Cringe. Where's my team, bro? 
Where's my team at? Your big Timothy 28 rate is goaded. There you go. Oh, Mercy of Brit has to be Colonel. Alright, that's just straight up disrespectful. Also, Mercy is a dingler, so until he becomes undingled in a uh, tabletop, his opinion is always less relevant to me. Put a negative win rate talking shit. <laughs> okay, if you have a sub 50% win rate, you should never talk to anybody again. In regard to skill level of the game. Like, win rate doesn't mean, like, an insane amount, but if it's, like, a below 50%, you should never talk negatively to any single person in any game that you ever play until that is above 50%. Because that means you are the problem in the majority of your games. <laughs> Yo, it's so fun. How are you doing, dude? I haven't seen you in a while, man. You come, but you tapping in for smite too. How are you been, man? What you been up to? Forty nine point nine. That's le that's less than half. Are they actually top down balancing? Based on the last patch, fuck no. They buffed Wraith in the last patch. Fuck no, they're not top down balancing. Sometimes they do. Like, some stuff they do, some stuff they don't. That was definitely a bottom-up balance, though, that's for sure. Bad rep. I feel like Crashy's gotten better rep recently than... I feel like people have come around to the Crashy train, honestly. I feel like the majority of people have started to come around to the Crashy train, honestly. It's gonna add you to the Excel sheet. <laughs> the real first thing, what are we talking about? I'll play a love pot game in the middle of competitions for realistically all fucking suck. Oh, I agree. 100% Granny. If you play the game currently, you actually suck, probably. Like, if a real player base started playing the game, we would all probably be shit. Where is the rest of my team at? I feel like I have like one teammate on my team. Like, where is everybody? Like, I actively feel like I'm just playing like a, like a 2v6 at all times. Like, what is going on? Little Timmy865, dude. Thanks for follow. That's a high-level Timmy right there, dude. You know, God, bear not bad. Crushy, you are shit, man. Shut up. You are fucking dog shit. Your ass is thick. I mean, that's different con- different- different topic. You know, different topic. I can't disagree with that one. Does Pokemon count? Let's talk about Infinite Crisis. Where's that game, though? Fucking dead game. That's right, dead fucking game. That's like me saying, like, I was pro on console smite, dude. You know where console smite is? Fucking dead. Bring <laughs> uh, me back to the glory days. The is my man not killing that guy? Thank you. I was talking shit. Yeah, no, keep doing it. Skill issue. You're just that dude. Which dude? The dude that shit at video games? I would agree. No, what was I saying? I think I think people are, are starting to listen, Crash. Maybe not listen, but like understand a little bit more. Bring up console smite uh comp because nobody cares. I mean yeah, because it doesn't exist anymore. But like you still have to respect it. It still existed. It's still a competitive scene. I 
guy's still on the resume. It's like saying I won PCC, like... Yeah, it's still a competitive team, you still gotta somewhat respect it. What's up, Bearded? How are you doing today, man? God damn! Dude, we need the dumpy duo back, Crashy. That game was fun. You care? Yeah, because you're in the scene. But if you were to say that to somebody else, you'd just get laughed at. Like, you loaded up League today and you were like, Hey, yo, give me jungle. I'm a PCC7 champ. They just call you a fucking idiot. <laughs> Only reason to play? I would agree with that. PCC who? Yeah. PCC these. Uh, I'm doing it right though, Bearded. Hope you're, I'm glad to see that you're doing well, man. Next Predcast win. Soon? Not soon enough. How has Jungle been treating you? I've been seeing you learning a little bit. Yeah, where are the boys, man? Where's my Gideon ult, dude? I literally have five... Like, I'm literally cooking people. There it is, finally. Holy shit, I'm dead now, though. Like, where is that when I'm alive, man? I'm literally 1v10 over here. These games only get kept by skill instead of social status. That's because it's a fresh competitive scene. Give it three years, the game... The comp scene will be... That way. Largely. Talk to my dev partners and get this content. Look, you must have missed the whole conversation today. All we've been doing is talking about how they're too slow today. I was really talking about how, as a, con as a content creator, there's only so much I can do for the game if the game doesn't release content for me to do stuff with. Unfortunately. Friendship League, indeed. Playing with pals right now? I got a couple pals you could play with, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Lasso? You see the end of season three? I mean, I want the game to do well. Like I said. The Phoenix value! Oh my god, the Phoenix value! I might as well stack my crest. But to me, it's the best takes. I believe it. I mean, maybe he does, dude. Maybe he does. But we had two Fang Tooths. Oh, my team just did it. Did we just do Fang Tooth? I'm so confused. I didn't pay attention. Where's the fault devs at? I have no idea. Dying so funny, wanted to do it again. Did people like actually just actively like to die twice? I don't know. BKB will play Greystone just so he can die three times. He's like, look, mom. 21 deaths. <laughs> The players only think about themselves, let Timmy speak to the players. True. I will rejoin you soon. All my friends are dead. I'll make sure uh first one I wasn't fraudulent. Hey, I ain't never lost a 1v1, I'm just saying. Push me to the edge, please no. How many devs work at Amita? I don't know how many devs they have, but they have 70 employees. I don't know how many of them are devs. True transition from Ward to uh, Sentry to Jungler? Pretty much every game, I would say. I don't do it every game because I'm just too lazy to do it in like casuals, but like in a competitive environment, like if you're trying to play like the best way that you possibly can, I would just say get sent for every game. 
I'm just too lazy to do it in casuals. Yeah, nice flash, buddy. I'll be taking that. Or Mercy gives me a run for his money on 1v1s. Dude, Mercy couldn't even 1v1 a minion wave. Never mind me. That guy is terrible. I was always said about 1v1, uh, one-on-one -on -one interview with Ace. See, I think part of that is, like, I really don't even think it's, like, like, he's a CEO, sure. But, like, I don't know how much of that stuff he actually handles. Like, when I think of Ace, I think of him as, like, the guy that talks to, like, the investors, right? Like, the guy that does, like, the upper level stuff. Like, I, I don't really feel like he's the guy that does the rest of the stuff. Like, I don't think he has, like, the say in balance. Like, he might play in, like, IT or something like that, right? Have, like, a little bit, but, like, I don't know. Do you person all team leads report to? Sure. But I feel like he's, like, like, don't they have, like, three CEOs? Or, like, three founders? Like, he strikes me as the guy that, like, has the charisma to talk to people to get stuff done. Or, like, to get, like, you know, like, funding and things like that, right? Like, I feel like he strikes me as that type of guy, but I could just be wrong. So not the community, not the, not community. I'm talking like high, like above the community stuff, like like investors and things like that. Like he builds the company, not like he's like part of the game. I guess I don't know if that makes sense. Like he's the company building guy. I actually don't know what he does. That's what he he strikes me as that kind of guy. Like when I talk to Ace, I'm like that's what he sounds like. But like he does do some of the other stuff. Like he will get stuff done. Like if if something's bugged and like he sees it, like. He'll grab a clip of it, or, like, you can send him a clip, and he'll try to get that stuff fixed when he has time, because he's, like, passionate about the game. But I feel like he's just, like, the deal guy and stuff like that. The base. Yeah, I mean, that's, like, kind of the way to, to put it, I guess. But he's, like, the company-building guy, I feel like. But I actually don't know. Maybe he's multiple, I guess. Maybe he does a, maybe he does a bunch of stuff. Do you like how I secured that prime? Smite div? I said OP practice. Five smites, no problem. Team players. All right, I'll leave. You got me, man. I'll leave. Anyways, get cooked, loser. No! 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 Fucking gadget, man. Deserved, deserved. <laughs> oh, fuck me, man. Fuck me. <laughs> nice hat. I'm glad you like it, dude. Thank you. Was surprised if I had Phoenix? I don't know if I would. I think I would have died to the Fang Rao. That's alright, we won the game. Worth. Not the spray on his body. No. I played the first Ascendant beta. I did not. Doing community service, giving out hats to the bald. I'm not even bald, bro. What?